Before we start, please close your eyes and listen the story. Let your imagination works. This story made with AI, with my imagination. I hope you like it. Let's get started. Once upon a time in a quaint little village, there lived a curious boy named Oliver. Oliver was known for his insatiable curiosity and love for adventure. One day, while exploring an ancient library, he stumbled upon an old, dusty book with an intriguing title, The Chronomancer's Tome. Unable to resist the temptation, Oliver opened the book, and to his amazement, he found himself transported to a world unlike anything he had ever seen. He walked up on floating islands suspended above a majestic river that seemed to flow through the very fabric of the sky. Confused but excited, Oliver discovered that he had acquired extraordinary abilities during his time travel. The islands were inhabited by mages, warriors, and swordsmen, each possessing unique skills and talents. Determined to make the most of his newfound powers, Oliver set out on a journey to hone his abilities and make friends with the fascinating inhabitants of the floating islands. Along his journey, Oliver encountered a wise mage named Eldora, a fearless warrior named Arik, and a skilled swordsman named Kira. United by a common goal, they decided to embark on a quest to become stronger and face the ultimate challenge— defeating the powerful dragon that terrorized their world. The group faced numerous trials and challenges, each designed to test their skills and forge their bond as a team. They trained under the guidance of Eldora, engaged in friendly sparring matches with Arik, and learned the art of swordplay from Kira. Along the way, they discovered the secrets of the floating islands and the ancient magic that bound them together— as their journey progressed, the bond between Oliver and his newfound friends grew stronger. They faced magical creatures, solved riddles, and overcame obstacles that pushed them to their limits. The group's determination and friendship became their greatest strength. Finally, the Day of Reckoning arrived. The group ventured to the highest peak of the floating islands, where the powerful dragon awaited them. The battle was fierce with fire-breathing roars echoing across the sky. Oliver and his friends fought bravely, utilizing their unique skills and working as a seamless team. In the end, through a combination of magic, strategy, and sheer determination, they defeated the mighty dragon. The skis cleared, and the floating islands seemed to celebrate their victory with a gentle breeze. As a token of gratitude, the inhabitants of the islands gifted. Oliver a magical artifact that would allow him to return home. With a heart full of memories and newfound skills, Oliver used the artifact to travel back to his village. As he opened his eyes, he found himself back in the familiar surroundings of his room. The chronomancer's tome lay closed on the table, a reminder of the extraordinary journey he had undertaken. Oliver couldn't help but smile as he realized that the friendships and skills he gained in the otherworldly adventure would stay with him forever, shaping the person he had become. And so, with a heart full of gratitude and a spirit forever changed, Oliver embraced the ordinary with a newfound appreciation for the extraordinary.